And I get to tell everyone on the board that I'm really excited that this day has come for me because I've been waiting for it since I became elected as a selectman. Because there has been a decision in D.C. that is going to be an infrastructure plan for the United States. And I would like to ask our state officials, our state representatives, our state senators, our U.S. senators, what their plan is. Because the infrastructure plan as presented, I was going through it today, and uh, the president actually met with mayors, other state and local leaders. I couldn't tell if anyone from New Hampshire was there. I didn't see anyone from New Hampshire, but I wish I had known, because I would have taken money out of my own bank account and flown there and met with them. And he's discussing a $1.5 trillion infrastructure plan. Paid for by the state. No, I'm going to explain States. what it is right now. <laughs> oh, it includes you? the creation of one federal agency to be in charge of completing environmental review within 21 months or less for infrastructure projects. Hopefully this will eliminate 10-year plans. That was my add-in. This was from the uh, national, national radio, national, I can, NPR. Half of the federal funding, $100 billion, will be used as incentives to entice cities, counties, and states to raise at least 80% of infrastructure costs. White House, will, White House will earmark $20 billion for transformation projects, next, cent, next century type of infrastructure. So as opposed to just replacing what we have, let's think about the future. All right? The commission I'm on is thinking about the future working together as a seacoast area and then hopefully the whole state to look at our infrastructure water-wise and see what we have going on. Now this plan also is not just water and soar, it's bridges, Hampton's got a bridge, we have plenty of roads. The spending plan will need 60 votes to pass the Senate. What U.S. Senator would vote against a nonpartisan issue like infrastructure? Well, according to our reps tonight, probably some will. So I would argue that the town is ready to replace its ailing infrastructure, water, sewer, bridges, roads. How about acquiring an Eversource? How about the state of New Hampshire? Funding guidelines have been outlined within the infrastructure plan, so let's go. What will be the actions taken by the state legislature and executive branches to ensure that New Hampshire gets funding and promotes funding sources? <coughs> Mr. Town Manager, I would like to, formal, I would like to formally communicate asking these questions to all New Hampshire Senators, Representatives, the Governor and his Council, Aquarian Water and Eversource, with the CC to the U.S. Department of the Interior and the President of the United States. I would also like this letter to be copied to Seacoast Online reporter Max Sullivan. And I would like to make that motion. I'd like to discuss it. Let me tell you, I see it entirely different than you see it. I see it that they have a one and a half trillion dollar bill and all they're putting up is $200 million, and then the rest of it's going to come from the states. I think the state's rainy day fund is maybe will come in handy because they're going to need it with this infrastructure yeah, bill. This is going to do right? nothing but cost the town of Hampton money. I, I don't see this helping at all. I no, disagree. it's all going for uh, uh, big highways, airports, things like that. The, I think it's ridiculous. And not only that, you know nothing about this, and anybody else doesn't either. Uh, there's not been enough information. I I've don't even know why we're discussing it here. For about 18 months. Uh, you know, unless you're some type of a, brain, a mind reader, I just don't think that this has any discussion here at this table when we don't know issue. any information. Why do we need to know the information? Uh, we have a $1.5 you know, trillion uh, dollar infrastructure uh, plan. We're One and a half on trillion dollars. It's, only, it's all coming from the states. Didn't you hear the rest of the story? Take I just read work. it, 80% to oh, find... No, it's Regina, that's not how I see it at all. Well, I think you're wrong, and I think we don't even need to yeah, discuss I, this let's here. Let's just sit here and continue what we've okay, been doing. Okay, we'll just, just sit here and wait till we get some year. better uh, discussion from the... from. We know nothing from about who? this. Who's coming here and telling us anything? No well, one. I think Mr. Innes was here at 8 o'clock. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, he was here at 8 o'clock. Oh, was he? Where was he? That was his point person sat there. Now they left. No, that was not Innes. Wasn't that his that point was, person? No, that was, uh, that was news. from the news guy. I'm the one that was sitting over I'm here? I'm pretty sure that was news guy, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Yeah. I saw his coat. Yeah. I thought that was his yeah. point person. No. But he, um, so I, let's ask him what their plan is. Well, I did plan to ask him, but I don't think you know Does enough anyone, about this to be making oh, any you don't motions. Even know what I know. Virginia, what do you have? You a, don't do you, know can we, what I know. Can we just get a point of order? Wait, wait, wait. Virginia, wait, wait. you're really Rick, upsetting Rick, me. please. You're, yeah, upsetting you're really me. Upsetting please. Me. No, please, hold on. She's got, a, she's got something I know, but wait a minute, please. to Mr. Trump. 
I know, but wait a minute. Come even, on, even this so, is ridiculous. Yeah, no Hold on. I would just rather wait on this simply this because ridiculous. it's a plan that was put out today and it hasn't yeah, been Yeah, and she formulated. knows everything okay, about it. But wait, don't argue against each other. I mean, at each other, please. Come on, this is ridiculous. All right, there's a, there's a motion. Do we have a second? Uh, I'm going to second it just so I can have some comments on it. Okay, or go for your comments. And, and, and uh, I think the intent of uh, Selectman Barnes' uh, interest in this has been demonstrated over two years now and going on three and I think it's it's good stuff I know when the MBTE disbursement of funds went up in in Concord other towns other municipalities got money and we got nothing and I think uh, the, for the spirit of it I, I don't think we need to vote on it tonight but a more more detailed plan and what the selectmen I uh, was requesting I, I would I would love to, to to work on that very quickly in my case because I'm going to be leaving <laughs> you lovely people soon all so. I want to know is was if anyone from New Hampshire there today because I didn't see him. Yeah, them. well, if so if you if that that would be my comment, and I, I've seconded it, and, it and, and perhaps if we could rescind the emotion and come back with a, a plan mm -hmm. um, in a couple of weeks, that might make more sense. When it's After more Mr. Trump calls her and tells her wait, everything. Wait, wait, wait. Not wait, necessary. Wait. They did that to me with, with Governor. <laughs> but don't forget it. <laughs> All right. Ignorance we, is bliss. We had a re ignorant. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, guys. We had a request to... Uh, <laughs> Rescind. I don't know if you want to rescind or not. I'll postpone. Postpone. Okay. Thank you very much.